important? Well, it's a uh, it's an integrated spotlight. It has a module inside there, not just a ball. It's the great thing about it. And integrated meaning I just want to make sure they know. It's not just a there's not just a socket inside of it. It's not just a socket. So uh, it, integrated means it's automatically LED. Yes, and we can we'll show them that. We'll pull them yeah. apart, and pull it up, show you the module. Um, but what's great about it is solid brass, just like the fixtures we showed yesterday, solid yeah. brass, not going anywhere. I mean, hopefully the camera is catching. This is stunning. This is beautiful. The finish is beautiful, the weight is durable, the elements aren't gonna be able to erode away anything here. Um, but there is something pretty special about this one. Couple things. Um, so, one of the special things is the fact that you can actually change the beam spreads. So, why is that important? Extremely important to me, and I, can bore, <laughs> and I can bore you with it for a very long time. Because when you buy a light from me, I want you to be able to pull that light out when you install it. You, know, I want you to be able to say, "Oh, Brian didn't know what he was talking about. This does look great." With this one, you can change the lenses out and you can fine tune what you want the light to do. So I'm going to back this up a little bit. I don't know if, if you've seen our previous ones, but Brian is the director of the tech team. So he, uh, his team is electricians and contractors and guys that are very well versed in how these fixtures work. He has a formula. If you don't, I'm going to call this sort of the all in one fixture, right? Absolutely. Um, there's a formula to get the right beam spread for what you're trying to illuminate. This fixture, you don't have to do that because it comes with the different beam spreads. So you don't have to decide which bulb do I do. I don't know. I mean, like, how, how would you know? You can go to Brian's team and you can say, hey, what's the formula that you have? It's, uh, 0.018 times your beam spread times your distance gives you an approximate. Okay, so if you have a 15 degree beam spread, you times it by 0 0.018, you times it by the distance that you're away from the um, item you're trying to illuminate, and that gives you the right beam spread, so then you know how to pick which bulb. But you have to show them this one because these lenses direct the beam spread. So you have three beam choices. 15 degrees. Which is in it. Okay, so that's narrow. 40 degrees, medium. And then what was the last one? 60 degrees, which is the one I have right here. Okay, so that's nice and wide. So, it's, you know, all inclusive. So we have a question from Dennis. Do they come in different colors? They do not. Um, right now, this fixture is just the electroplated bronze. Um, so you, right now, you cannot. And here I was thinking he was talking about colored lenses, and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we can't talk to him about color. This is a 3,000 Kelvin um, color temperature, and we yeah, might as well go right over to yeah. it. So, um, you know, for the holidays, or if your favorite color is red, or you just want to add a pop of color in the yard, they've got red, orange, and we'll do a demo so you can see these, green, and blue. All of these are included with the fixture. So you have the three different lenses for your beam spread option. You have clear, plus colors for your color option included. And this steak, we've been showing you steak, but this one's pretty amazing. It is heavy duty. And, and what's what's that little, there's like a little, a little stuff there. there. It's, just so yeah. that it's easier to slide your wire in there. When you're going to install it, you slide your wire in okay. there and then it twists. It's just easier to use. All right, nice. Um, so you get hit with a lot of questions like which bulb do I get, which beam spread do I decide? We were in a conversation earlier this morning about that, absolutely. And how nice is it to have the freedom to relax and go, I can put a dozen of these in my yard. 
I need my palm trees lit up, so that's a 15 degree. I need overall, you know, the uh, bushes lit up, and that's maybe a 40. And if you want a broad graze for maybe a wall feature or wall texture, that would be 60. Um, but you wouldn't have to panic that you purchased the wrong bulb. It's all in one. That's right. And we, I think we've touched on it, but we haven't uh, talked about it much, is you can change how bright you want it as well. Oh, no, we didn't talk about it. <laughs> I feel like this is an infomercial. Wait, there's more. <laughs> Hold on. Absolutely. So I forgot the lumen output. So you can go from low to high. We're not talking about dimming. We are literally talking about the brightness, which sounds like to me, but it's very, very different. I yeah, think so we, we talked about how this is a module, not a bulb, so you can see that's an integrated LED right there. Okay, I'll just tip it over, over a little farther, and this is the module, so that's definitely not a light bulb. So on the back side of the module, this is actually how the, the wiring is connected to it. So. Uh, if, if this module did go out on you, you could actually replace this. Mm. Uh, where there's sometimes some integrated fixtures, that's it. That's right, the whole fixture has to. Exactly. So this here is a dial selector. I can come up here to you. Yeah, that'd be great for them to see. So this actually is where you adjust your power. Okay, so this the power adjustment is from two and a half watts all the way to 10 watts. So roughly speaking, 180-ish lumens all the way to 750 lumens. Okay, that's amazing. So you would need the brighter lumen output if the item is further away. And um, you would go a little less brighter. Uh, I forgot about that feature, it's like such a big yeah, deal. Like you were talking about, if I was um, shrubbery, I just wanted to light up my bushes. Maybe they're as tall as this table, three, four feet wide. I need to back this up just a little bit, put my 60 degree beam spread in there. Right. I might only need two and a half to three watts. I I'm not trying to blow it out, I'm just trying to highlight right. it. Right. And so that's where I would it. use it. Wow. Okay. So um, this really is a one stop shop. Absolutely. So you have lumen output. You have color change and you have beam spread. Yeah, no wonder why you like yeah, this. You yeah. will like this because it truly is, it'll do everything for you. Exactly right. And then being solid brass, you're going to have it for an extremely long time. That's mm -hmm. what I like. So, yep. does everything, solid brass, fill the last. Yeah, excellent. And what's nice is um, keep these because as your foliage grows, you know, and becomes more mature. Let's say you're starting off with a little tree and all of a sudden five years deep, um, you would want a little bit more lumen output. You can do that. You don't have to exchange the fixtures out. So this will grow with the maturity of your landscaping. Yes, it will. I'm getting more excited about it. <laughs> We're talking about it. No wonder why you like this one. Um, that's fabulous. Anything else? We're going to do a demonstration, so hang on. We'll just show them the light. Other than that, I mean, it's, it's all in one. We talked about it. Okay. Where you, it's important for you to see. Okay. So let me go ahead. Like right now, I have the 60 degree in here. Okay. So I had it turned all the way up to um, to the 10 watts. Okay. So, so I can't really play too much with that. Okay. We have a daylight window here, so you're, hopefully you'll, the up. camera will pick up the. Uh, Sit right there. And that's right there. Okay. So you can see we're approximately six feet um, off the ceiling right. right there. And that's a... That's a big span. That's a very big span. So obviously that, that's a good seven plus feet at least, I would say. Bigger yes. than maybe a small shrub that I would normally Absolutely. Do. So, But this wouldn't be six feet away. Usually it's only going to be maybe, you know, two, three feet away mm -hmm. or something from it. So it's going to be a little smaller. Right. Could be a good uh, wall grazer too. Textured wall. Yep. Okay, fabulous. All right, so there's your 60 degree. It's so simple. I mean, look at how easy this is. He's just popping it out, putting another one in. Yeah. 
I've got clear lenses. Yep. We can just throw these on top later on for you to see color. I'm uh, at the 40, correct? I do have the 15, yeah. This is the 40 degree right here. Okay. Definitely okay. smaller. Absolutely. More intense. More, in, more intense mm -hmm. and smaller, that's right. Let's go right to the 15. They're marked too, obviously, but just in case, it's marked on the side. So if you do the little, like, you know, shuffle game, you'll still be able to find the one you want. Okay. And there you go. Oh, yeah. It should be a lot more intense. There you go. Much okay. smaller beam spread, a lot more intense. And that's what's so great about it right there. Mm -hmm. You want to see, we're just going to plop these on top. So you can see, that's how easy it is. When you take off uh, the shroud in the uh, unscrew, you'll just put it right on top. But at least this way you can see uh, how easy it is just to get a modification of color. That was the orange? Yeah. Okay. And green. green. All right. it's, it's very easy. Awesome. I'm not sure if the cameras are picking that up, but it is very intense for and her and I are seeing it in doing a really nice job yeah it does come through the camera with a hot spot because of the direct the camera's picking up the hot spot so okay but you, the outer ring is showing the color they just don't see like oh, we do it's all green yeah. we don't see the difference in the hot spot but they do no i, I don't see a hot spot at all it's, no it's, it's very it's, it's a very really even nice. even yeah. color huh. well that's well, fantastic so if you have any questions even if this is a repost, go ahead and um, put it in the comments, or you can call 800-865-7221. If you have a fixture that you like on our site and you just want to know a little bit more about it, definitely call or write a comment to us, and we will make sure that we do a video on that product. Uh, we're, happy, we're happy to help. That's what these are for.